When it comes to the Cup and you find out your first opponents, it's it's always an exciting time, isn't it? And you now go into the competition as defending champions. Yeah, um, it's definitely difficult to not get caught up in the Cup. Um, we want to take it one game at a time, focus on the first game and try to get that first win. But Cup's always exciting. Um, it always has a good atmosphere and a lot of hype around it. So, yeah, we'll be looking forward to getting into Cup action soon enough. What do you think were the keys to your success last season in the Cup? Um, I think we really bought in. We had a really turbulent start to the beginning of the season and Mark came in and just built a really nice atmosphere amongst the team. Uh, everybody really got on board and we worked through, we worked towards the same common goal and uh, backed ourselves. Uh, nobody else did, so we had to. And what are the attributes you think that you have in your current squad that will you know, hopefully lead you to success? Um, I think we're gaining, um, we're, we're continuing with a lot of experience from our team last year. And we have lost uh, Ella and Jenna, unfortunately, they've both moved abroad, but we also gained Leilani Turner and Claire Amelia into the squad. So hopefully we'll have Mimi Troy back. We only had her for two games and she was a big loss to us. So it's a lot of positives to add and hopefully we'll build week on week. Um, so what, what will the likes of Claire and Mimi, you mentioned those two players, what will they bring to the, to the team? Um, well, they both bring a huge amount of experience. Um, Mimi, we only got two games out of her last year, which was unfortunate, but we're really looking forward to getting her back on the court with us. Um, just like her dad, she is massively into her defence and is a real threat on both ends. And Claire comes with just a wealth of success and a great attitude, uh, always team first. So it's always a really enjoyable time to play with her. Who do you see as your big rivals going into the new 23-24 season, both when it comes to Super League and, of course, Cup? Um, I think it's kind of an impossible question to answer right now. So many teams have really changed this year. Um, I'm not sure anybody kind of knows what to expect out of themselves, so I think it's going to leave for a really interesting League and Cup campaign. So it's all open, you think, you know, anyone can come through? Definitely. I mean, you look at last year and even down the bottom of the league, there were so many talented players amongst those teams. So I'm sure they're going to build throughout the summer and uh, come back fighting this year. What would it mean to you to retain the Cup this year? Uh, it means everything. It's such a special event. Um, the club, we're so lucky. Um, it's one thing I really count my blessings for is the club that I'm a part of. Cluster is such a strong family bond from development all the way through to Super League and senior teams. And uh, my under 13 girls, they I coach them several times a week and I'll go from coaching them and they'll come and support us. So seeing them in the stands cheering their hearts out means so much. So it's really nice to be able to kind of put on a good show in the cup um, and kind of give thanks for all the support they have given us throughout the year. So it means a lot and hopefully we'll be able to do it again. And Colester, a club with plenty of cup pedigree, having won it so many times over the last number of years. Yeah, definitely. Um, it was my first one back in 2020, second last year. So it'll be nice to make this trifecta this year.